In this video, we're going to learn how to use WordPad, which is going to allow us to create text documents where we can store any sort of text information we like. To run the WordPad application, I'm going to put my mouse down here on the Start menu, click on All Programs, go up and click on Accessories, and Accessories has a list of programs that come with Windows 7 and I'm going to go ahead and click on WordPad. And we should see WordPad open up in a new window and it's going to go ahead and let me type some text. So I'll click on my page and I'll type my text. If you'd like to go down to a new paragraph, press the Enter key on the keyboard and now I can type in a new paragraph. And if you'd like to backspace or erase some text, use the backspace key on the keyboard and that will erase to the left of your cursor. And if you'd like to do any formatting, you can highlight words. You can either do that by clicking and dragging or you can double click on words. And you can use the formatting tools at the top. For instance, I can change the font. I can change the font size. I can even apply a bold, an italic, or an underline. I can even go in and do change the font color by clicking on this arrow, choosing a new color. And I can even do some paragraph formatting over here. For instance, I can change the alignment of the paragraph. And if you'd like to go ahead and save this as a Word document on your computer, sorry, a text document, I should say, we can come up to the Save button up here in the top left. I'll click on that, and it's going to open a dialog box to ask me where I'd like to save it. I'm going to put this in my Documents library, so I'll click on that. And down here, I have to give this a file name. Call that whatever you like. And it's saving it here as a rich text format document. That's fine. There's actually different types of documents I can save it as by using this drop down menu and choosing one of the options. But rich text format is fine. And I'll say save. That'll go ahead and put that in my documents library. In WordPad, we also have a little menu here. I can click on that and this gives me some more options. For instance, starting a new document, opening a document, saving, printing, exiting, all kinds of options are in here. If you'd like to open a file, simply click the Open option. It'll ask you which file you'd like to open. I can try my text file, say Open, and that'll go ahead and open it up inside a WordPad. When you're done, you can press the X in the top right, and that will close it down. So there we have using WordPad. In the next video, we're going to look at how we can pin things to the Start menu.